Oh, come on, baby. You know who it is, and you know what it is, baby. Let's look alive, people. This is J-Rock, and J-Rock is here to react to some more Death Stranding. I got to admit, this game has kind of piqued my interest. Inch by inch. And so now we're going to check out a boss fight in Death Stranding. Let's see how this goes. What J Rock is cooking? Finally, J Rock has come back to you too. Oh, what is happening in 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 with the millions of J Rock's fans? You're here with J-Rock to check out some gameplay from Death Stranding. And we're going to check out a boss fight. Hang on, J-Rock. Got to adjust the camera just a tip, pat bit. A little bit more. A little bit more. Here we go. J-Rock is going to check out some gameplay from Death Stranding. So let's check out and see this boss fight and how it shakes out. This game is starting, it's starting to pick my interest a little bit. Now, I'm not saying it's enough for me to go out and buy the game. But I'm starting to look back and be like, hmm. Okay. This might be one of those games where in order for it to make sense, you actually have to play it. Because it will reveal itself throughout the game. I don't know. But anyway, let's check out and see what this is all about. Do was it? What you can call that bubbling crew. We walking. All of y'all who remember the Beverly Hills Bill. Ah! 
now. I'm just trying to figure out what the what are the VTs attached. Because it looks like if you just keep it, keep it at a distance, and really much you can do. Watching some gameplay of the game, watch a couple people uh, play it. Shout out to uh, the Rad Brad. Uh, watch them play it. Tyrone Magnus, shout out to him. Uh, watch them play it. Just some random gameplay here and there. Um, I think I watched some Game Spot yesterday. Um, talk about some things like, you know, the baby doesn't like to be submerged in water for too long because it upsets them. Um, the, and that's where I learned about the blood-based weapons against this thing. Um, so, I'm not going to sit here and say that I was where I was a couple days ago where I was thinking like, okay, this game just sucks. I mean, that was my opinion based on what I had seen thus far um, up to that point. But trying to keep an open mind and get more information about the game and say, okay, all right, there might be some things. Because there's been plenty of games where... They didn't tell you everything all up front. There was some there were some things that, you know, in order for you to figure out you actually have to play the game. But um it's it looks interesting. I I will say that. It went from looking like hot garbage to interesting. It it has piqued my interest. Um so it may be a game that somewhere down the road, once all the hype dies down, uh I might get it on um game fly and check it out um, because I'm still not sold to where I'm going to spend $50, $60 on the game but who knows I'll uh, more than likely check it out on game fly later on um, man I'm playing a lot of games right now back and forth with NBA 2K20 uh, um, I'm playing the first division game again and the second one I'm still on Borderlands 3. Uh, what other games am I playing? Um, I already played Gears 5. I already played that. I love that game. Big fan of the Gears of War uh, series. Looking forward to uh, next Friday, Jedi, The Fallen Order coming out. Um, not sure what console I'm going to pick that up on yet, but... Man, a lot of good games um, have gotten delayed until next year. Probably until next holiday season when the PS5 drops. Um, I'll be getting that first because PS5 got the got the uh, exclusives on lock. I mean, it's just Xbox, you just came to the party a little too late. And so they got all the exclusives on lock. Um, and so I think Xbox, y'all got to, you know, step your game up. Because right now, PS4 and PlayStation and Sony is killing it. Anyway, post your comments down below. Let J-Rock know what you think. If you appreciate and enjoy J-Rock's reaction, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and share. Um, oh, yeah. Want to tell you guys, uh, once I get to 100 subscribers on my channel, I'm going to be doing giveaways on my channel. Uh, it might be gift cards. It might be games. Who knows? Um, probably gift cards to start out. Uh, but in order to be a part of that giveaway, you got to uh, be uh, hitting that like button, subscribing, 
to the ch and be a subscriber to the channel. Um, and so, yeah, and I'll be announcing the winner once I start doing that. But again, got to get to 100 subscribers first, and then I'll start doing giveaways on the People's Channel to the millions and millions of J-Rock's fans to show his gratitude for you guys watching. Um, but anyway, um, again, subscribe to J-Rock's channel, the People's Channel. Uh, make sure you hit that like button and you share and let the world know that the YouTube People's Champ, baby, J-Rock is here. All right? Uh, go to my Facebook fan page down below if you have a video request you want me to check out. Make sure you go there and put it. And if I choose your video, I will give you a shout out on the People's Channel. All right? Also, Make sure you hit that bell so that you can be notified that it is time to be electrified. Thank you for joining J-Rock. Until we meet again. If you smile, la, 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 what J-Rock is.